Hello and welcome back, guys. Um, oh, uh, now there was a, an update in Besiege, so now it's version 0 0.08 instead of 0 0.05. And I mean, they added so much cool new stuff for just like 0 0.03 things. So, Ypsilon, when you uh, have conquered an island, it now burns. And there is. Where is it? Where is it? There is a new island, which is called Tolbrind. And the cool thing is, they added like everything is like uh, um, ruled by Duke Ar Aras. And sadly, there's only the first, uh, like, yeah, levels. And uh, the others are coming soon. But at least they'll release this instead of letting us wait for the whole thing to be done. And there's so much cool new stuff. Um, they also added new items, and I built something that actually works. And I have to show it all to you. Okay, let's uh, let's jump right in. <clears throat> Alright, so in this level, what you're supposed to do is you have to kill all the knights. Now, from what I understand, uh, this this Duke Ar Aris, uh, this Duke Aris, is like pleading for you not to attack and is offering gold uh, that's what I understood but maybe I'm wrong also there's these cute little guys and they play the trumpet um also there's a new animal two actually but you'll see that later this is one of them the other one is only slightly different um, it's a yak or something I don't know um, <clears throat> Okay, so the cool thing in this level is um, rock is now actually destructible. Well, on this island, not on the previous island, is now destructible by either extreme force or by a new item, uh, which would be the drill, which looks like this. Uh, the drill, and not just by bombs. It still says the only blockade will destroy brick, which is true on the island Ypsilon, but uh, yeah, let me show you one of the machines I made to get rid of all this. Okay, so this is the car I built. Um, well, it's kind of, this is to demonstrate how you can destroy the new brick by force. This is just some kind of battering ram thing I made. It's a bit, it's a bit, little and bit mixed into one word, bittle, overbraced, but it works, so let's give it a try. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Boom! Did you see that? Holy shit. And it's very cool. So, the problem is you have to destroy some of this. Um, because you have to kill all these all of these knights. And there, there's one here, and another one over there on those towers. Um, so let's get rid of these. We don't want your gold, we want to kill you. We don't care about gold. Oh, yeah, this is my classical uh, all-terrain vehicle. I use it for many things. It is basically just the frame with this type of suspension, because this type of suspension is awesome. Because it rolls over anything. Oh, careful, there's a fire thing in there. I don't want to get burned. And there goes my car. Um, charge! Yeah, look at this. Die. Oh, my wheels are spinning around again. Okay, I mean, this isn't the best car after all. I told you it was overbraced. Look at those braces. Jesus Christ. Uh, yeah. Well, it's still doing its job, you know. Destroying stuff. Go, 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 go. Boom. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and also there's these new rocks here that you can also destroy. By force or by drill, yeah, you can also destroy them with bombs. Jesus, what is wrong with this car? I told you it was overbraced. Okay, so yeah, if you compare this to the car we had before, I guess you'll recognize something. Like I said, it's the car I use for many, many things. Now, I have these two things in front which I can move up and down with drills on them. And then have this fixed drill in the middle. 
I have three drills up there, so that any debris that gets uh, any debris that gets you know that falls onto me won't destroy my car because we don't want that. Um, let's put these like like this kind of, and let's go. So with these, you don't have to go in with force. You can just like gently touch it, uh, and there we go. Yeah, this this. This messes it up big time. Um, let's make. Okay. Come on, tower, fall! Timber! Yeah. Well, it's not exactly wood, so maybe it's just bring, uh, like, cool. Say. Bricks? I don't know. Um. Doesn't sound as nice, though. Does it? Let's go. Bricks! No, that's not as cool. Um, I have to say timber. Ah, timber. Yes. Who is still alive? Oh, you have to be kidding me. See, and a normal vehicle might not actually have gotten out of this mess, but this one does because it has an awesome suspension with it, which allows it to uh, have traction even in weird situations. Ah, oh, come on, just die. I hate it when this happens. Die, 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 die. What is, what is it with this guy? Is he like... What is it with this car? There we go. There we go. So yeah, this was the zone and the introduction to the new items and things you can do. There's actually one more item, uh, I think, yeah. And I'll show you that in sandbox. I don't want to spoil all the levels for you. All right, here we are in the good old sandbox. They haven't changed anything here, and this tower is made up uh, out of one of those older brick. And you can't destroy those with drills or with force. Uh, I spent some time ramming it with drills, but it didn't work. <laughs> um, yeah. So there's this one new other item, which is the here the grip pad which is high friction. Now it might seem a bit useless but I guess you can put it on like these big wheels so that they uh, don't slip as much. I tried that once and the wheel doesn't work as well anymore but um, I guess it's useful for like walkers and stuff so let's try that. So here we are, a ten-legged walker. Uh, first we're gonna try this with uh, the shields which are commonly used Four feet of walkers because they are thin, light, and but have a bigger. Um, yeah, they're bigger. So this one is left, right, left, right. So it works pretty well, also because it doesn't really slip. Um, let's see if we can walk up this thing. No, not quite. See here, it slips. Let's see if that happens too with the grip pads. Alright, so let's see if it even walks with the grip pads normally. Yeah, it does, quite well. Oh, oh god, that's just me not being able to control it properly because I'm, uh, I built it but still I'm not very good at it. Okay, yeah, works quite nicely. Haha, <laughs> die! Can't walk backwards though. Uh, <laughs> Alright, now let's try it this way around. I think it goes a bit higher, but it still doesn't quite walk up all the way. No. Maybe it's just the walker itself, you know, not quite being uh, the best. Uh, we could try, though, to, um, to make it walk up this slope. Let's have a go at that. I think that slope is flatter. Or maybe not. Um, yeah, so all in all, for what we saw here, the grip pads are a bit useless. Um, but I guess, you know, someone will find a better use for them than me. <laughs> um, okay, on to the next thing, thing. Okay, so what this is supposed to do is kind of 
reel in this line. Now, there is a thing with grappling hooks here, but I haven't managed to uh, get it to connect to this tower. So I guess I'm just gonna let it break off, you know. Um, just to show you what it is for anyway. So what it does is basically um, it rolls up these things and I think that's well quite interesting and if there wasn't this stupid thing in the middle we'd actually able to do, be able to do it. Um, okay so let's try this again. Um, roll up, roll 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 roll, come on, don't get stuck, don't get stuck. Come on. Come on. Oh. Lag. Okay, lag, 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 lag. There we go. Now it works. <laughs> and something that we can see, which is pretty cool, is that they kind of um, interlock when they do it right. So in the middle they did, and the outside it messed up a bit. Uh, but let me just pause this and show you. So, you can see here that they are very close uh, one to another, and if I unroll this, you'll be able to see that, <sighs> okay, you won't be able to see, but they basically, they do uh, what is almost happening here, oh, what is almost happening here, um, so they're going between one another. Which is cool, because that saves space. And now, something by me that actually works. By me. So, um, it looks like this, uh, kind of stupid. I just made a random design and somehow it worked. Then I, better, uh, I made it a bit better and it worked even better. Um, so, yeah, this is on zero and when it's on zero, things fly up. Sorry, sorry, not a good first impression. But it works. Look at this. Wait, where is it? Okay. Um, now, this thing works beautifully for the fact that I made it. And that works pretty darn nicely. I just need to learn to steer it a bit because. Uh, okay. Should be able to. Yeah. This flies quite well. Um, there's four p propellers. You can see um, these these four propellers here. They go on by themselves. I'm not touching the keyboard right now, um, and that's because the thing can't land anyway. It doesn't have any wheels. It has to fly, and um, <coughs> yeah. So these keep it going. Uh, keep keep it going forwards. And the others uh, basically steer it. And then there's these things that keep it stable. And the stupid uh, starter block, which is quite heavy. I could I could have ignored that by just dropping it, but still. Oh. So let me do that one more time. And then that would be then that would be it for this episode. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe, leave a comment, leave a comment. It's even more important because nobody leaves comments. Send something in because I mean I'm making a besiege series, and in besiege you can send stuff in. So do that, and I will be sure to show in one of my videos. If someone is making something um, or has already made. I'm just I'm just kind of stupid. Um, so. I'll show you that next episode. It's basically the X-Wing from something that someone else already made. Just the problem with that one is it doesn't have any weapons, and that person added weapons, which is awesome. So yeah, bye. Thanks for watching. Um, I'll make I'll make a download for this in the description if you want to. I'll just make a download for it because I'm so incredibly proud of this and it works so well. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Bye-bye. <laughs>